Good afternoon, Cigar View 72. We've got the Diesel Ultimate Maduro Presidente size, which just means it's their seven inch uh, 58 ring gauge cigar, which I think should really be the cigar size that every cigar is made because it's amazing, it looks good, and it lasts a long time. Uh, Diesel is made by A.J. Fernandez. Fun fact, A.J. Fernandez has made every cigar in the world for the past 400 years. It's not a real fact, but it certainly seems that, that way these days as he has his names on everything. But, you know, it is what it is, and I do like this cigar. Uh, I was not going into it with super high expectations, but it has a great taste. I'm getting notes of orange peel, a little bit of chocolate, graham cracker, and even what I would call kind of campfire, right? That nice smell of wood burning, which is different from the cedar taste you sometimes get that kind of smells like the inside of a humidor. So it's, it's a great tasting cigar. It's now burning extremely evenly. There's one moment where it looked like it wasn't, but it kind of self-corrected with without the need for a torch, right? So it just auto-corrected, which I liked. And it draws extremely well. And I mean extremely well. As far as faults go, right? I talked about the good things. What are its problems? It doesn't really have one. Um, you can see here, and you probably can't see here, but on the wrapper, I can see the lines where they use the leaves to wrap it. Not a big deal. Something that some of the cigar brands manage to avoid is it kind of looks like one giant leaf, but on a cigar of the size, it's not really possible. The only other nitpick that I have is that they do have the label on the foot and not a label up here. I like labels at the top of the cigar. It has nothing to do with the quality, just my own personal preference. And I do think that Diesel is a better name for a mangy pit bull than it is for a premium cigar, but they didn't let me name it. I don't know why, but I do like it. One thing I would point out, it's strong. It is, a, this is a strong cigar. Very, very, very full bodied. In fact, so much so that, I mean, I almost never start feeling ill when I smoke, especially if I've eaten. I just ate an hour ago, and this is making me feel a little, little woozy here, primarily because I'm probably smoking it too fast. But as far as you know, everything goes, it's drawing well, burning well, and it tastes great. The great thing about this cigar, six bucks. I think it's like five seventy-five if you were to buy a twenty-pack on Cigars International. This cigar would be pretty hard to beat for a cigar that really is in the five-dollar price range. So that being said, if you're looking for a large, full-bodied, good-tasting cigar, this is it. Now, different cigars for different occasions. Would I smoke the cigar, if I golfed, on the golf course? No. Unless you like feeling ill, and then by all means, smoking in the hot sun on the golf course. Would I smoke this in a small room in my basement? Again, probably not. But for you know, nice weather like this, out on the back porch, great cigar. I strongly like it. My only other nitpick is that the shirt makes it look like I have boobs instead of pecs. Not a fault of diesel. It's my own fault for wearing the shirt for the interview. But that's Cigar Review 72, the Diesel Ultimate Maduro Presidente, and I'm going to have to recommend it. It's a strong recommend, especially for the price point. As always, leave any feedback and have a good day.